<laughs> yo, yo, yo. What the heck, man? Miami, Miami Dolphins, 70. Denver Broncos, 20. <laughs> oh, I can see right now, this, this is going to be a wild year. 70 to 20. Wow. That's pretty bad, but it's trust me, it's worse scores than that. I mean, well, week one, the Cowboys beat the Giants 40 to nothing. Yeah, the Cowboys beat the Giants in New York at home 40 to nothing. Getting shut out to me is worse. <laughs> when you got shut out, that's like more embarrassing to me. Every team's been shut out. Cowboys probably got shut out. Every team probably got shut out. But 40 to nothing is pretty bad, too. They got shut out. <laughs> at, least, at least the Broncos didn't get shut out. They scored. But 70 to 20, that's pretty funny. Dolphins. Dolphins are woke. They also got the, they got the record for being the only undefeated team. The Dolphins. Only team that ever that never lost a game a whole season. And won the Super Bowl. Cause uh the Patriots did that. <clears throat> the Patriots with the whole season. Never lost a game and then lost the Super Bowl to the Giants. <laughs> but back to this. 70 to 20. Where to go, Broncos? I bet Sean Payton saying, well, man, I wish I <laughs> wish I would have stayed back on the Fox set. <laughs> but who else? Let's check out these, some of these old other scores. The most lopsided win was in 1940. The Chicago Bears beat the Washington Redskins 73 to nothing. <laughs> wow. That's the worst one right there. And that was an NFL championship game. Wow. <laughs> I think the most points came from when the Redskins beat the Giants 72 to 41. There were a total of 16 touchdowns. 10 by the Redskins and 6 by the Giants. <laughs> wow. Plus a field goal by Washington kicker Charlie Gogolak with only seven seconds left in the game. Old Sonny Jurgensen was the quarterback back then. And the Redskins beat the Giants at D.C. Stadium. In 1950, the Los Angeles Rams beat the Baltimore Colts 70-27. They had the record at one time. 70 to 27. Wow. The Broncos did get embarrassed in one of the Super Bowls. Washington 42, Broncos 10. When Doug Williams lit it up. John Elway was supposed to be the star, but Doug Williams ended up being the star. First black quarterback to start and win the Super Bowl, really. My Cowboys embarrassed the Buffalo Bills in two Super Bowls. I remember this one. They beat the Bills 52-17. to 17. <laughs> And Thurman Thomas, I used to call him T.T., little T.T. He couldn't find his helmet. <laughs> yeah, right. He didn't want to play. That Dallas Doomsday defense was lighting him up. That defense was nasty. <laughs> 